<laughs> At least they let me keep my good foot, right? <laughs> Nelson Thomas is focusing on the positives. One year after a near-fatal car crash, the star of MTV's The Challenge is recovering after having his foot amputated in a planned procedure on March 5th. In March 2023, Nelson was involved in a car crash that left him unable to walk for three months. The reality star was rescued from his flaming car in Austin, Texas by Minnesota Vikings player KJ Osborne and three other Good Samaritans. Now, Nelson is sharing with fans in a new TikTok video that he's received a below knee amputation on his right leg. I'm home, I'm home, thank God, thank God, man. Um, it was a hard three days. The first two days I was in a lot of pain. Walking into that hospital, I was very scared, but I had my loved ones with me. I had my mom, my titi's over there washing dishes, and I had my friends, and um, I had to elevate my leg for the next six weeks, and I had to take a couple pills. I gotta make sure I'm moving it so it won't get stiff. Trust me, people, it is weird. It is weird. Um, I still don't know how I feel, but right now I know I'm home and I'm happy, and that's all that matters. I'm just gonna take it day by day, and we'll see how things go. Nelson shares he has high hopes for his future. In the video, the 35-year-old can be heard telling medical staff he's already eyeing the 2024 Paralympic Games. Um, we know it. I'm already talking to a coach about the Paralympians on August 24th. Oh, yeah. This year, what do y'all think? <laughs> yeah, you'd be a miracle, man. <laughs> Nelson shares, I am truly blessed, and his support system in the comments agrees. Fans are sending him lots of love, along with his ex-girlfriend, former MTV co-star Angela Babbage, who writes, wishing you a speedy recovery. Following his 2023 crash that led him to receive a DWI, Nelson has undergone six surgeries, including receiving three plates and 22 screws in his right leg. And after months of physical therapy, stem cell therapy, and electrical stimulation, Nelson was told he had a non-union or unhealable fracture in October, so he opted to amputate. Nelson told People Magazine last month, I met peace with it. I've done everything I can to try to save my foot. There's a lot of people out there, even friends. They're calling me, Nelson, you have a chance to keep your foot and look normal and walk around. But then you have to ask yourself, what kind of quality of life do I want to live? We're wishing Nelson a speedy recovery.